Is Pastor Gino Prophet Elijah? Let us find out. Hello friends and family welcome to another reaction video with Apostle Gino Jennings. We believe that Jesus Christ is Lord and He is the Creator of heaven and earth according to the scriptures. This channel is for educational purposes only. Let's watch and learn. All right, Dan, the man, let's have it. Uh, this letter comes from uh, a listener that says, Pastor Jennings, who are you? This is my third email in three years. All your predictions are exactly sharp, but I have one question. Who are you? Why am I asking you this question? It is I, I, I really don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but the last time I checked, I, I was Pastor Jennings. Uh -huh. And I'm not trying to be anyone else. Right, that's right. What I mean by this, a lot of preachers have so much admiration for men in history, whether it be past or present. Yeah. They try to live off someone else's legacy. That's right. Only one I'm trying to live by, what code I'm trying to live by, is the laws of the greatest one that ever was, is, and will be. Amen. And that is God himself. Amen. Amen. If I can live to please him, I have accomplished something. Oh, that's right. I have accomplished the most difficult feat in the world. That's Amen. Right. Amen. Come on, brother. Let's have it. This person says, why am I asking you this question? It is just because the arrival of all predictors, prophets, are predicted in the Bible. So are you this Elijah who's supposed to come just before the return of Christ? No. Oh, no. Um, I'm trying to put that on <laughs> Homie don't roll like that. <laughs> oh, no. You ain't putting that on me. Oh, no. Now, it is a very good question he's asking because if you take note, many men in religion, mm -hmm. they are so caught up in themselves. That's right, sir. Until they call themselves the Messiah. That's right. Amen. Others say they're God. That's right. The nation of Islam said that the honorable Elijah Muhammad is Elijah. Mm -hmm. That the scripture says should come. That's not him either. No, no. The book of scripture tells us who this Elijah was. This Elijah mm -hmm. was the son of Zachariah. That's right. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> And the son of Elizabeth. That's right. In the book of Luke. Listen. In the book of St. Luke, chapter 1, and we'll begin in verse 13. I want to clear my name. That's right. <laughs> Glory to God, I want to stay clear. That's right. Amen. I'm just a humble servant. I'm going for that. That's right. Sent by the God of Elijah. Amen. That's it. That's it. All right, get back to that. <laughs> That's right. Come on, brother, let's have it. Luke 1, beginning <clears throat> verse 13. Yes. But the angel said unto him, Fear not, Zacharias. Uh -huh. For thy prayer is heard, and thy wife Elizabeth shall bear thee a son. Yes. And thou shalt call his name John. Mm -hmm. And thou shalt have joy and gladness, and many shall rejoice at his birth. He shall be great in the sight of the Lord, and shall drink neither wine nor strong drink. And he shall be filled with the Holy Ghost even from his mother's womb. And many of the children of Israel shall return to the Lord their God. Yes. And he shall go before him. He shall go before him. In John mm -hmm. will go before him. In the spirit. In the spirit. And power. And power. Of Elias. Do you hear that? That's right. So that's not me. That's right. What did John and Elias had in common? And, and he shall go before him in the spirit. And power. And in the power. Power of Elias. The Elias called fire from heaven. That's Amen. right. John was born with the fire from heaven in him. That's right. That's right. Uh, That's right. Do you get what I'm telling you? That's right. And that fire that was from heaven in him had the title Holy Ghost. That's Amen. Right. Elijah was girded about with camel's hair. That's, That's right. right. So was John. So was John. Right. So uh, that's that. That's not me. <laughs> Glad how Pastor Gino cleared this up. Some other preachers would take the credit. Many have called themselves God. Right. Come on, Dan, let's have it. So are you this Elijah who's supposed to come just before the return of Christ, this person asked, mm -hmm. or someone else in the Bible? Uh, no, I'm not no specific individual in the Bible. Right. My name don't have to be in the Bible. That's right. No. That's right. But I tell you what Jesus did say. That's right. Give me Luke 11, 49. That's, right. That's it. Amen. Amen. Luke 11 and that verse 49. What justifies my arrival. <laughs> That's right. That's right, sir. 
Listen. Luke 11 and verse 49. This is the promise that Jesus made. Therefore also, Therefore said, also said. The wisdom of God. God's wisdom. I. 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 I will send them. Will send them. Prophets. Prophets. And apostles. And apostles. I will send them. God said I'm going to send them. Prophets and apostles. Now. You must continue to look for that until God comes. That's, That's right. right. Look for that. That's right, sir. He said, I will send I them. Will. And remember, go ahead, go ahead. Paul's name wasn't mentioned there either. That's right. That's right. That's right, sir. Paul came after, long after. That's right. That statement was made. That's right. Acabus name wasn't mentioned there either. Amen. But Acabus came way after that. That's right. So the scripture says in the book of Ephesians, chapter 4, and verse 11. It itemized the officers. That's right. The positions. That's right. That God have set in his church or among his people. In Ephesians Amen. 4 and verse 11. What is it? And he gave some apostles. Some apostles. And some prophets. Some prophets. And some evangelists. Evangelists. And some pastors. Pastors. And teachers. Teachers. For. Why is all these offices given? For the perfecting of the saints. For the completion of the development of God's people. For the work of the ministry. For the work of what? Work. For the work, work of the ministry. That's why the these offices is here today. That's right. So the work of the ministry can keep going. It didn't stop. No. When the apostles, the names you see in the scriptures died. That's right. It wasn't ordained to stop there. That's Amen. right. Why? The Lord haven't came yet. That's right. Because the church is still here. Yes, Amen. So the same thing that God had then. Glory to God he has right now. That's right. And I thank God that now I'm here. That's right. And, and you, some don't like the idea like that. that I'm here, but God sent us. That's right. He sent us and gave us a divine skill. That's right. Just like he given the apostle Paul. I have given them thy word. Listen at this. In St. John 17 and verse 14. This is what Jesus was praying. That's right. That's right. <laughs> and he testified what was done to his apostles. That's right. Said he what? I have given them thy I word. I have given them thine word. And the world. And the world. Has hated them. Oh yeah. That's right. Explain how I know what I know. Amen. How is it that I'm able to go into the scriptures and strip them down? That's right. As using fractions, break them down to the lowest common denominator. That's right. My divine skill was godly given. I didn't go to no seminary school, right. never took no Bible course, I never studied theology. Amen. Never. Never. But you question me about this God of heaven. That's right. Question me about his law. Amen. Pick up any subject you want to talk about in the Bible. That's right. And say if the God of heaven don't drop me in it, take it apart, split the atom, and show you the nucleus of it. That's right. Wonderful. That's right. Yes, sir. My skill God is God given. God given. God Amen. I have to credit God. I can't credit nobody else. That's A lot of preachers will never say this type of stuff because they want to credit themselves. Right. right. I didn't get this from my mother. No, no. No, I didn't get this from my blood father. Amen. I got it. I got it from God. That's right. That's right, sir. Only God Himself can instill such boldness within a person. Amen. Where they can challenge the governments and religions without fear. That's how God makes his preachers. Amen. These preachers out here don't represent God. Amen. If they represent God, they wouldn't be so scared That's and right. so right. weak and Amen. such a coward. Amen. They Amen. wouldn't do that. That's right. That's right. That's right sir. Amen. That's right. That's right. If a man is sent of God, Go ahead. his preaching will never, never deviate. Never. Never. From what God said. That's right. So my skill is God, God given. I, I, it was given to me. That's right. Amen. Amen. He gave Amen. it to us. Just like he told Brother Jeremiah, right. I've put thine words in thine mouth. That's right. You know, Jeremiah was a young fella, you know. That's right. And in the book of scriptures, Jeremiah chapter 1 and verse 5, and I, and I love this. Amen. Listen at this. Jeremiah 1 and at verse 5. What is it? Before I formed thee in the belly, I knew thee. Every man of God that's called and sent of God is a predestinated man. That's right. Amen. For this calling is in the life of every man that God have ever called 
and God have ever sent. Amen. He's predestinated. Amen. Preordained with a divine mission. That's right. To do a divine work. That's right. He's an ambassador. That's Amen. right. Giving the privilege and given authority. That's right. The privilege to represent authority from authority. Wonderful. Listen. Before I formed thee in the belly, I knew thee. You didn't you, you don't think God knew me before I was born? Amen. Certainly. God knew us. And, and before thou camest before forth out I of the womb. Before I came out of my mother's womb. I sanctified thee. I was set apart. And I ordained thee a prophet. I appointed thee a messenger. Unto the nations. Unto the nations. Then said I, ah, Lord God. What? Behold, I cannot speak for I am a child. What do you mean I am a child? That's have a twofold meaning. That's right. Not only a child in age, but when you are a child, your speech is not yet developed. That's right. That's Divine right. maturity. That's right. That's, right. That's right. To speak the That's right. things of God. That's right. That's right. That's right. So your speech, you must be given the tongue of the land. That's right. That's right. And to obtain the tongue of the land, you must be taught of God. That's right. Listen, real quick. But the Lord said unto me, Say not, I am a child. But thou shalt go to all that I shall send thee, and whatsoever I command thee, thou shalt speak. That's what got my mouth barking like a pit bull. That's right. That's right. Everything God says, and Amen. I mean everything. Amen. Amen. We will speak it boldly. That's right. Without a inch or a raindrop of fear. That's right. I don't fear nobody in the world. Be not afraid of their face. And I'm not who you are. That's right. Any king, any Hallelujah. prince, any man, any woman, black, white, yellow, red. I don't care. Be not afraid of their faces. The only one I fear and the only one I bow to Hallelujah. is God Himself. That's right. God Amen. and God only. That's right. There's not a human that is born or will be born. Amen. That a strike fear in my heart. Wonderful. Other than God himself. Amen. And because God put this fearlessness. Go ahead. Go ahead. In his preachers. Go ahead. You cannot represent God and you're scared. That's right. Oh, no. That's right, sir. Oh, no. Or either intimidated. No, That's right. Yes, sir. Uh, where we have no fear. It doesn't matter who come in any building in this session. It doesn't matter what religion you represent. Five percent is one percent, three and a half percent. Amen. Islam, Buddhist, Mormons, right. I don't care what you are, That's Ku right. Klux Klan, uh, Grand Wizard, Grand Master, the devil out of hell himself. That's Amen. right. That's right, sir. Be not afraid. Even the devil got the answer to God. That's, That's right. right. Amen. Don't That's you right. know that? Amen. Amen. The devil got the answer to God. That's right. Oh, yes. That's right, sir. Come on, Sam. What you have? Be not afraid of their faces. Unless I confound thee before them. For I am with thee to deliver thee, saith the Lord. Now what did God do? Then the Lord put forth his hand and touched my mouth. That's why my mouth is always jumping and running Hallelujah. off at yes. the mouth. Amen. I have to go back to the past. That's right. I often say this is a blast from the past. That's, <laughs> That's right. right. That's right. God got to touch the person's mouth. Mouth. Right. Amen. What do you mean, touch it? Anoint it. That's right. Oh, yeah. The anointing of God must be in the man's mouth. Amen. That's it. That's right. There was a prophet by the name of Isaiah during the time the king Uzziah died. He said, I saw the Lord and his train filled the temple. Yes. Then he said that I was a man of unclean lips yes. among the unclean people, but there was some coal right. there cold. at the altar. That's right. And there was a seraphim that took the tongue. Hallelujah. And with the call, hallelujah, hallelujah, touched oh, the yeah. mouth That's of right. the prophet. That's right. But the call was live call. That's right. That's right. Now, why would live call hallelujah. be needed That's right. upon the mouth of the hallelujah. prophet? Amen. Right. When the coal is live, hallelujah. it is set in the fire for a That's while. Right. That's right. Man. Hallelujah. Man. That's right. Now, if it's set in the fire for a while, right. fire does two. It does two things. That's right. Consumes. It consumes. Mm -hmm. Burns That's right, sir. and purifies. That's right. That's right. So the prophet needed live coal live upon his coal. mouth. That's right. Because the speech was unclean. That's Amen. Right. So Amen. before he can speak the things of God, Amen. God had to put live coal. Oh. Live coal represents the presence of God, Amen. the power of God, right. the anointing of God, so it can burn out all unrighteousness. Oh, that's, right. that's right. Amen. That's it. That's right. Amen. You see, God put live coal. Live Go coal. ahead, brother. Oh, his presence. Go ahead. That's right. On my mouth. That's Amen. right. That's why three gods is not coming out of it. That's right. Amen. 
That's right. That's right. That's right. Are you listening? That's right. Burnt all that stuff out. That's right. Amen. That's why the belief of women preachers is not coming out of it. That's right. Burnt all that out. That's right. We don't separate Jehovah from Jesus. That's right. Burnt all that out. That's right. We don't have no God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Ghost. These three are one. The live coal burn all that out. That's yeah. right. We don't have no faggots up here. Go ahead. Uh, live coal burn that out. Man. That's right. That's right, sir. Go ahead. Man. Are you listening? Amen. 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 That's right. Go ahead. Okay, guys. Thanks for watching. Comment below what you think. Like, share, and subscribe. See you soon. Hope you guys learned something from this. God bless you.